Hi folks, welcome to Revision, and welcome to this week's ESO Price Guide. So let's get started. Alright, looks like the wars in Mournhold continue. Uh, looks like two traders went down this week. And this is going to be a reoccurring theme, probably for the next, I don't know, probably the next few weeks or so, uh, until things stabilize. So we could see a major shakeup in Mournhold to where there are new incumbents that uh, take over cer certain spots. So don't be surprised if you see some guilds not there anymore and uh, some guilds that are new to the scene. And with that being said, um, let's get right into the price guide. Temper alloys are going between 4.5k to 5.5k. Druze wax is going between 2.7k to 3.3k. And Rossins are going between 5k to 5.5k. Fortified Nurncrux, not much change, going between 1 to 3k. Potent Nurncrux, a little bit of a spike. Um, that's going between 11k to 12k. Platinum Refined for a stack, uh, that's going between 8k to 10k. For the platings, the blue plating is going between 10k to 11k. And I'm starting to see supplies uh, thin out on the blue plating, so might be some opportunities to uh, raise your prices on those goods if you see supply shortages. Purple plating, also kind of a weird market this week, uh, going between 30k to 35k, so definitely uh, good for selling. And yellow plating has gone up quite a bit uh, because of all the shakeup in Mournhold. That's going anywhere between 84k to 89k. So good opportunities to sell there. For a perfect row, uh, not much change. Uh, going between 13k to 15k. The supply is kind of iffy, so uh, keep an eye on things there. Ethereal dust, man, this is taking a beating. This is now into the 90k range to 100k range and they definitely want it under 100k so prepare yourselves i hate to be the bearer of bad news but ethereal dust is no longer going to be 100k probably um sometime next week because the prices are bottom bottoming out for the exp potions the 50 percent potion that's going between four to five k the 100% potion going between 9k to 11k. I don't know why they're making it that cheap, but whatever. And the 150% potion, that's going between 28k to 30k. Alright, for my pick of the week, I chose the Oko Runestone. And that you can find anywhere from a unit price of 150 gold to 200 gold, with an average stack price between... 30k to 40k. So, good opportunity to sell your Oko rune stones if you have uh, a lot of those in in uh, supply. All right, folks, that concludes my ESO price guide update for this week. If you like this video, please hit the like button and become a subscriber. I put out videos on Elder Scrolls Online each and every week, and I'll see you next time.